Hello guys and welcome to Excel Shorts. In this series you're going to learn Excel skills at a rapid pace. It's all about minimum inputs and maximum outputs. So guys, without wasting any of your time, let's get into this little episode, Heat Maps in Excel. Right guys, I want you to replicate this uh, little table that I've got here. It's basically uh, six months, Jan up until June, and it's spanning over three years, 2019, 2020, and 2021, with some random uh, amounts populated here in the uh, cell C3 to E8. I would like you guys to replicate this data, and then once you've done that, you can basically highlight your data, and let's say we, this is sales. This is sales amounts, we're tracking sales, and we want to see the highest amounts versus the lowest amounts and in this specific range. So you highlight from C3, to E8 and you go to home up above you click on conditional formatting and you'll see here color scales so as we said we're tracking sales we want the most top number to show a darker green and if you click it there the, it shows you in February 2021 is our highest month of sale our lowest was in Jan 2019 and how the sales compare in this range quick and easy if you want to do the opposite, let's say we're tracking expenses, just going to quickly hit undo here. We're going to do the same, highlight from C3 to E8, go to home, click on conditional formatting, color scales, and we're tracking expenses. So our top amount will be our public enemy number one. So if you click on it, so you'll see in February 2021, it shows it now the highest amount in red. So this is the uh, month uh, that has the largest expenses here so both ways quick and easy guys um if you think i deserve that like button and subscribe button please do so click here down below and i'll see you for our next excel shorts next time outro here we go